Well, who invented the calendar we all currently use in modern society? It's called the Gregorian calendar. It was invented by the Catholic Church, by Jesuit priests in the 1580s. Because what are we trying to track? We're trying to, it's so Earth goes around the sun. How long does that take? Well, it takes a year. It turns out we're not actually tracking how long it takes Earth to go around the sun. We're ha tracking how long it takes Earth to repeat its seasons. The year that corresponds to our seasons is slightly different from the year that corresponds to how long it takes to go around the sun. And that difference was not recognized in the early calendars. The leap day overcorrected the calendar. That one day every four years was slowly putting too many moments into the year. Because it overcorrects, how long do you have to wait to remove a leap day that you would otherwise put in? That's every hundred years. So every hundred years that would be a leap day, you remove the leap day. Now it turns out that undercorrects it oh. <laughs> by an even smaller amount. How long do you have to wait before you have to put a leap day back in? Every 400 years. The year 2000 was a century year, which normally would not have a leap day, except it's a century year evenly divisible by 400, so they put the leap day back in. This was hard-earned, and the whole world uses this calendar. It is the most accurate calendar ever devised.